deadlifters. So a lot of people love to jump to the conclusion that great deadlifters all have amazing leverages. That's not necessarily the case. So I'm not arguing that there aren't some outliers that that does apply to, but again, we're talking outliers. Uh, generally, a great deadlifter looks like the bar moving less because of their technique. So I'm gonna use myself for an example here. I'm five foot 10, average, but if we wanna look at ling limb length proportions, which is gonna give you those leverages, we're gonna look at the ape index. The ape index is a measure of inseam to wingspan. So mine is 100% normal, average, but both my conventional and sumo lift look like I do significantly less work. And in fact, I do, but again, that's technique. So the lifter on the right is someone that shared this video to show what a deadlift should or would look like if you don't have those perfect leverages like uh, top deadlifters do. And you can see, or you will see based on the lines here, the, the hip starting position is gonna be in the same position and the barbells are nearly in the same position or the weight is nearly in the same position at the completion of the lift. However, again, uh, about an inch lower on my side because I'm two inches shorter and I'm also not uh, hyper extending and pulling the, the weight back uh, too far at the end. But uh, you can also see that there's significantly more risk of injury just besides the performance loss, uh, which is why, again, we see more weight lifted with proper technique. So please, you know, don't look for excuses. Work on your technique. Become a better lifter. It's going to save you in the long run for your health and increase your performance.